don't miss a beat join the notification squad by clicking that bell you'll get notified every time i upload a video and be sure to join our discord to talk and get help with your code Hey everybody, we'd just like to take a moment to thank the guys over at SkySilk who made this video possible. SkySilk is a Linux-based cloud hosting platform built for developers with plans starting at just $2 a month, and they're currently giving every new sign-up a free $100 credit to try out the platform for 60 days. You can get started in just a few clicks over at SkySilk.com. Hello guys, and welcome to our fifth episode of our Discord.js tutorials. Today we'll be making a reports command. It's kind of the same command, like the video we've done before on this channel but now I'll be getting rid of the deprecation things and adding several amount of checks to make sure the command actually works in certain um, happenings so let's get started create a reports.js command okay let's make our basic file setup uh, we're going to be using a rich embed object or constructor rather discord.js we're going to be using strip indent again common tags and our command setup exports name is report no uh, category is moderation the description is report a member uh, usage is either a mention or an id so mention or id and then our run function client message arguments um, first of all we're going to check if a message is deletable message delete deletable uh, if true, we're going to delete the message. Delete. Uh, we're going to be getting a member. Let report member is equal to the mention we get. Members first. Or message guild members. Get arcs one. Uh, zero, I mean, which is the ID or the mention we provide. Um, if no member is found, we're going to be returning a message. Rep down. Reply. Oops, I couldn't find that person. And then we're going to delete the message. Then and after like, let's do five seconds. Which is 5000 milliseconds, of course. Uh, if we don't know if the member is either a bot or a or he doesn't have band members permissions we're going to return another message ban members or the member is a bot uh, uh, return message reply cannot report that member and then delete the message after five seconds too we'll just copy and paste that there you go um, if there's no arcs one or no reason to the command you're not going to report a user or a member for no reason so we're going to return message channel send Please provide a reason for the report and then delete it too. Um, we're going to be finding a channel to send the reports login. So message guild channels find channel channel name must be equal to logs uh, reports whatever you want uh, if no channel has been found return message channel send I could not find a report oh. reports channel and delete that um, our embed it 
yeah, let's make something nice. Embed is a new rich embed. Uh, set color to red because it's a report command. So red's nice. Uh, set timestamp. Set footer message guild. Name, which is the name of the server and the message guild icon URL which is the Im image of the server set author hello okay um, reported member message our member user display avatar URL and now our description strip indents member is the R member and uh, the ID. There you go. And now uh, the reported by is going to be message member and the message member ID. I reported in message channel and reason of course arcs slice one join and send the embed two to the channel send embed. Let's try the command up. We could add a return here too. Um, a node and run it. There we go. As you see, the command is loaded right here. Uh, let's go to Discord and oh, and I got a suggestion of someone to make the prefix a global variable. So just put it here. Okay. Uh, So as you see right there, the message got deleted and it got sent into the reports channel, reported member Anish by Stan in general. And the reason testing this command is avatar and the server icon. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and um, make sure to join our Discord server, subscribe to the channel and like the video. Goodbye.